What if I told you that there is a way for you to save money for your landing pages if you have a website on Squarespace, on Wix, or on uh, WordPress, and if you use a ConvertKit. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to create beautiful landing pages for no extra cost for you using your website and using ConvertKit. Listen, even if you don't use ConvertKit, like listen up or watch this video because your email marketing provider might have similar options for you to build your landing pages outside of your email marketing. All right. So, um, what we're going to talk about today is how to use ConvertKit, how to use ConvertKit forms, very important forms, and how to combine them with your website. Also, what we're going to talk about is what is landing page and how you should position your landing page. So let's go. Before we dive into actual training, let me tell you that your messaging and what you put on your landing page matters because there are three mistakes that entrepreneurs who are selling high ticket offers are making right now. And this is why your landing page, it may be beautiful. It may look good, but people are not signing up. Or if people are signing up, they're not signing up to work with you because you are probably making one of those three mistakes in your messaging. So I created 11 minute, no fluff, zero fluff training, how you can improve your messaging right now. Check the description box below for this video and grab your training today because again, I can't stress it enough. You can use whatever you want. You can follow this tutorial. You don't have to follow this tutorial, but if your messaging is off, no matter if you're creating the most beautiful landing pages, people are not going to buy because people don't buy your landing pages. People buy your messaging. So uh, check the uh, training below. It's just 11 minutes. It's absolutely free. And now let's jump into the tutorial. Step number one is to actually go to your email provider. And in, in my case, it is ConvertKit and in ConvertKit and your email provider, if you're not using ConvertKit, it might be a little different, but in your email provider for ConvertKit, you need to create a form. Let me say it again. You need to create a form, not a landing page. So how do you do that? You go to grow right here and you select landing pages in forms and you click on it and then uh, you create new and again, you select form because you can embed your landing page in landing pages in ConvertKit. Let me say this. Unfortunately, they're not as good. They're not optimizable. You can't really do a lot of uh, thing. They just, they just don't look good. And your landing page, your squeeze page, your lead magnet is your front door for your business. And if you, if the front door looks ugly, nobody is going to open that door. Okay. So this is why I say, let's create a beautiful website, beautiful landing pages with your website. So form it is now, uh, the second important thing, it is important for you to pick in line in line form. You don't need a modal. You don't need to slide in. You don't need a sticky bar. None of that. Simple in line form. Now in in line form, again, we're going for simplicity and I will explain exactly why you need to select as simple form as you possibly can. And I go with Claire. I love Claire. So in uh, here, you can name whatever you want. Uh, so in here, I will, uh, so we have an email mark, we have an email, we have another field, and I can, let's say, I can say that it is a first name, and I need another field, and let's say 
for now to feel I select let's say source. So I'm not I... gonna go over like the backhand uh setup for your land for your form because on the back end like, you wanna you, you wanna specify uh, like, what is your incentive? You want to add an incentive email because, like, otherwise your customer will get that, hey, thank you for subscribing. So it's a real estate where you can say, hey, grab your training, grab your checklist, grab your freebie, register for webinar, do, like, do whatever you want them to do. And then, like, the link, right? Like, you want either, like, uh, I'm I'm gonna come back to it later, but you want them to redirect them to your landing page. So now uh, let's go to um, Squarespace, and this is like this is my website. So I kind of made it made everything bigger so you can see what I'm doing. And now we uh, actually create like we actually going to create not linked page. So landing page is a page that is not linked to anything and this is really important because you don't want them to distract to go and read about you to go and connect with you on social media like you have one job with your landing page is to grab their email is to grab their name grab their information and deliver a lot of value with your either webinar or like course like whatever it is whatever it is this is essential so i'm going to show you how to do it right now so uh and create blank page and uh, like before i even edit that you see that like we have this navigation part so you we have the menu we have the logo we don't want them here like so in navigation like i hope you can see that in navigation i select show header and show footer like we don't want none of that so now we have like this youtube tutorial as an empty page now we can go ahead and edit that now uh i do not recommend you to use any pre-built components for your website because none of them look actually good so what I suggest is actually go and create a blank, like absolutely nothing on it section. Why? Because now you can create whatever you want. So, and um, let me explain how the, how landing page is like working. So first of all, we need to create like embed form so we can say embed and we can edit that and we can actually create a code snippet so how is it useful so now we can publish it and when we publish it we can actually copy that little code that we have and we have javascript we have html we have share uh we have wordpress we have uh unbounce uh we have different options that you can use them. So because Squarespace is not the only the only option. So whatever you use, I use JavaScript. If you use WordPress, I use JavaScript. So and I copy that, and I go here and I go to copy uh, like to the code thing, and I just copy and I paste it. So I made it a little bit smaller. Now, your landing page, uh, your title for your landing page is, um, is really essential. So, and normally the way I use it, I say, are you, and then you wanna in, like insert your ideal customer, who you're talking to. And this is one, like, this is what you deliver. So let's say you are a career coach. You're know, like, I, you, I don't know, like I, you a software engineer who is looking to increase their salary or who is looking to transition into management, or are you uh, an executive who is looking to build their personal, life? whatever, whatever you're selling, like, this is like, this is what you assume they want, like your offer. Uh, then this like 
your thing and it can be a sem like it could be a freebie it can be a checklist like whatever it is whatever it is you give them for free if you give it for free so you can let's say in my case it is a trading and and i do value stacking here like benefit one benefit two benefit three and now I'm going to save and I'm going to exit and you're going to see how it looks like. So now like this is like, the, like this is, this is really important. So for messaging training, right? Uh, you want your um, landing page above the phone, right? So you want uh, really easy, really quickly access them. Uh, like who are you talking to? When they're going to get? your form that you copy from the website and you want to provide some sort of images. So like, now we have this bare bone, like a uh, landing page. So, and now the beauty of that, that landing page, this is like, this is really bare bone. So like, it, it, it should look, uh, it should look a lot better than that. Um, but this is the thing you can, uh, edit your, um, landing page as you like because now you can also um create a thank you page on your um website and on on your thank you page you can actually deliver them your freebie your training your podcast like whatever it is and you can uh literally in the settings let's say uh put a link for your uh, freebie, right? Like if you want them to navigate directly to training, you can de navigate them to, um, directly to training, or you can create a thank you page that will lead them to your resource. So like the, there are so many ways to do that. Like, what is important for your landing page? Your messaging is important. Your messaging is important. So if you want your landing page work, you have to figure out your messaging. So I have a free resource for you. And that free resource is a 11 minute training on messaging, 11 minute training, how you can fix three fundamental mistakes that a lot of entrepreneurs who sell high ticket offers are making right now. So the training is, is in the description box below. Um, and also uh, let me know what you think. Let me know if it was helpful and let me know if you want more tips and tricks how to integrate tech in your business so you don't have to overpay for tech in your business. I hope it blesses you. Um, I will see you next time.